Oh, hello gamers. Oh boy. What? 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 Oh, disappear. Nope, I got him. You need uh, you need blue for that. I have tons of blue for that, by the way. Ooh. Oh, almost. Boom. Oh, nice. What? 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 Can I reach? Oh, wow. <laughs> I can. Hello, gamer. Did you just talisman swap? No, they surely had that talisman on, right? What? Oh. GG's. Good fight. Nice. Dude, I'm really, really impressed with the end of that combo. That range was pretty insane. Dude, what? Okay, I got a good look at it there. Hello, gamer. Oh, I like your shield. That's a huge shield. What? 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 Oh, he's shield poking. Uh-oh. The good old Radon special. What? 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 Oh my god! <laughs> Holy crap! <laughs> Hello! <laughs> they were heavy rolling, so uh, they, they did not have a shot to dodge any of that, really. <laughs> I think they dodged it, like, once. Oh, God! Oh, so close. Oh. Magic door? Magic door. <laughs> Magic floating swords? <laughs> Bloop. Do it again. From literally behind them, though. That's crazy. <laughs> uh. Oh, don't hit into the glint blade. What? Boom! Nice, let's go. GG's. <laughs> oh my god, I hate Grey Sword of Damnation. I hate it. It is so dumb. It's so dumb. Oh no. Hello gamers. Oh man. Okay. Oh jeez. Oh! They're not dead! What? Oh, heal up. Woo! What? What? Oh man! <laughs> Alright, I got one. I got one. That means they have to commit, right? They have to commit to the fight. <laughs> Let's go. Oh. Oh. I am the boss now, not Mesmer. Oh. 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 Darn it, dude. I wasn't quick enough on that. Oh, oh they're low still. <laughs> oh. 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 Boom! Dude, I love that finishing. So the finisher is like one of the best parts about the combo. Are you jumping off? Yeah, GG's. <laughs> That's fair. That's fair. <laughs> oh my god. This thing is so much fun. I gotta get better at the resource management for sure. But it's good. And it's blue. Hello, blue. How you doing? Oh, sheesh. Blue, can you take this guy out? I want to test something. Thank you. Oh, nice. Oh, oh, oh. oh boy. Nice. <laughs> yeah, that's some good damage there. All right, let's see where the host is. Oh, I see him. He, he has Dark Moon. Oh, I see him and a Phantom. I believe. I think the Phantom's the clear cross right there, right? Nice. Oh. Hello. Yep, there's the Phantom. Oh, sheesh. Whoop. Hey, you guys gotta do me a favor and kill and kill mobs. That's how you guys play this game. <laughs> oh, no. Alright, blew up. Nice. Oh, okay, I was about to say, dude. I did get the mobs. Hello, gamer. Whoop. Okay. Dude, they are killing so many mobs. I have a damage boost right now. 
That's insane. GG's. I don't know why you guys were killing mobs, man. Don't you know it busts my damage? <laughs> okay, stop. <laughs> oh my god. Boom, boom. Nice, dude. Ah, Knight's Lightning. Nice. Okay, charge. Charging. Oh man, they're getting some good blocks over there. Uh. Oh my god, it was worth it. <laughs> Alright, Physic. Alright, let's jump over there. Hello, gamers. Whoop. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Oh, nice! <laughs> Oh, you're still alive, wow. Oh, now they're dead. They bled out. <laughs> How'd they survive all that? Interesting. I'll figure that out. Hello, gamer. Oh. Oh, okay, that's good damage, though. Oh. Oh. oh, no, they're trading with me. Okay, I just gotta do this old-fashioned. Oh. Heal up. Oh, no. All right, two-hand. No! Dude! This host is so powerful. Oh, there we go. Man, I just needed to get that one. Boom. Oh, <laughs> I just needed to get one swing ahead of them. Oh my god. That's wild. I mean, I would use the blue there, you know? Huh. Oh, maybe I need to get that full combo. Oh. Hello, bonfire duelists. How y'all doing? We gaming? Y'all doing some good old ganking? Bonfire ganking? Oh boy. Oh, you don't have a lot of health. Oh! He should be dead. <laughs> well, he is dead. Oh, darn it. Close. Oh! Nice, GG's on that guy. Oh, hey, there's a hunter. Yeah, you guys kind of need it. <laughs> Bonfire gankers and all that. Whoop. Heal up. Oh, okay. Cool, I'll finish this. Charge. Oh, <laughs> he's already running back. Oh, no, he's actually hiding around the corner. Nothing really changes, sir. Ooh. Oh no, the the rock. All right, let's blew it up. <laughs> hey, come on, you're the one ganking. You can't follow through with your own gank. Come on, ganker. Ooh, star shower. Floating swords. Glint blade charge into star shower. Oh, nice. Oh. Woo. Oh, okay. Boom. 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 Oh, darn it. I don't know why I thought they were going to fight. Blue. Oh, okay. Where are you going, sir? Man, it looks like your blues aren't coming up as fast as you need them to. You pretty much consistently need the 2v1. Hello, gamer. Oh, God. Blue, it's a 1v1, man. <laughs> Boom! Nice. Come on, ganker. Fight's not over. What? <laughs> what was that? Charge? Does he not see me? I guess not. Hunter, it's literally just a gank. <laughs> Blue gankers. Oi. 
Man, you just really, really like ganking. Oh! Oh, come on. So close. Oh. GG's ganker. The dude, the dude couldn't get out of his crouch because he's a ganker. He doesn't actually know how to play the game. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just so sick of these type of DLC gankers. It's just like, dude. <laughs> Do something else. Hey. What up, guys? This is the build I was using in this video. It's my rune level 200 dex intelligence build. It's mostly intelligence. And I'm trying out the Starline Sword. It is very fun and also very strong. However, you can see it has a B dex scaling. And on this build, I have 42 dex, which isn't too bad. But uh, I, it's mostly a intelligence build. I'm mostly a caster. However, this sword really does help with the close combat scenarios. Um, line of stars. So this thing is insane. So you do one L2 for this, second L2, third L2. That third L2 has pretty insane range. <laughs> it's, uh, I had a lot of fun trying this weapon out. I find, at least I found this weapon to pair really well with the floating swords. Cause then you could just, you know, hit everything there. Glint Blade also helps in this scenario. And then I have Star Shower for some range pressure. Most of the times when I'm using Star Shower consecutively, they start to rush me. They like they dodge under and then they try to get at me. And then that's where the Star Line Sword comes in. Boom! Yeah, if you see that range, the range practically doubles on the katana. <laughs> it's pretty insane. Uh, but dude, I had so much fun using this thing. I also have the Rotten Wing Sword Insignia, the Warrior Jar Shard. Blessed blue do the blessed blue do talisman, but I also have switched it out quite a bit with the crusade insignia, because uh, you don't always need the blue do talisman. But it is nice to just like swap, like at at a at like the the end half of an invasion when you have like only a little bit of blue left. Uh, but crusade insignia is still really good for damage buffs. Uh, you just have to be in the right spot. Like it's obviously not going to work in a two v one bonfire duel or whatever. Um, <laughs> two v one bonfire gank. Also, Godfrey's icon would would have been good for like star shower and stuff, but I didn't really want to focus on that. I wanted to, to focus on buffing the damage of the line of stars. Very very strong. It doesn't just completely one shot people, but the combo is really really nice. It chains together really really nice, and there's like a specific way you have to dodge the the end part of it, you kind of have to dodge to the side. Cool. Yeah, because you can see it's mostly vertical, so you can you have to dodge it to the side. If you dodge it, if you try to dodge away, I believe it roll catches you if they're able to move. It, it depends. Um, but yeah, I've really enjoyed the Starline Sword, dude. It's very, very strong. I enjoyed it. <laughs> I, I enjoyed it a lot. Uh, it was fun. It was fun. Now, is it better than Moonveil? Uh, the thing here is Moonveil actually scales with intelligence pretty pretty nicely, so unlikely it's better than Moonveil. Um, but yeah, it's it's weird. I don't know what they were thinking with some of the uh, attribute scalings on some of these weapons for the DLC. Like, to be completely honest. <laughs> I guess they didn't want this sword to be too strong, but then it's like, dude, you have D scaling on a weapon that requires 21 intelligence. Like, that's kind of crazy. But who knows? Who knows? I'll tell you what, though. If you have a dex build with only 21 intelligence and you have, like, 80 dex, this thing is probably shredding. <laughs> so <laughs> so it's nice. You can have both these swords for your dex not intelligence build. But, yeah, that's pretty much it. Not too crazy. Really, really enjoyed the Starline sword. It was fun. Cool. It's only three L2s, by the way. It looks like a lot more. <laughs> uh, but, yeah. That's the build. Thanks for watching.